So you're looking for how to buy hosting from Hostinger? Perfect. First things first though, be sure to click the link in the description or the pinned comment as they keep it updated so you're always getting the best deal and you can follow along step by step. And be sure to hang tight because there's an easy way to knock the price down even more coming up. So when you do click the link, you'll arrive on a page that looks very similar to this. They might change it around a little as they always do, but as you can see, up to 75% off web hosting and some other great benefits that I'm going to show you how you can actually use. Let's click on the claim deal button right here. And upon doing so, it's going to allow you to pick the perfect plan for you. So if this kind of looks, you know, like there's a lot of numbers going around, what do a lot of these features mean? I'm going to help you choose between which plan you might want to use. So I don't know anything about you specifically, but let's start off. If you are starting from scratch, you've never created a website before. This is going to be your first one. You're really excited about it. Premium might be best for you. Okay, so you get everything you need to create your website. It's going to be $2.99 a month for a 48 month term. I will talk about the terms as well as we go on. So with this, some of the biggest perks here, you get 25 websites, which is nice, 25,000 visits monthly, 25 gigs of storage, and another bigger one here is going to be 50 mailboxes and weekly backups. So if you're just getting started, that will probably be perfect for you. However, there is going to be the business plan, which is the most popular. And a big reason why you might want to use business compared to premium, even if you are new, it's only $1 more per month. So with this, you can level up with more power and enhanced features. So if we scroll down right here, you're getting 50 websites, 100,000 visits monthly, you know, you get 50 gigs, you also get 100 mailboxes. And one of the biggest features that I often talk about is the daily and on-demand backups. It says protect your website data with automatic daily and on-demand backups. Daily backups are stored for seven days and weekly backups are stored for seven weeks. This is a feature that I always point out because compared to the previous plan, you get weekly backups. So if you're like me and you're prone to breaking your website, or you might think that you might be prone to breaking your website. I have done it before. And the great thing about this is that if you just say break it or something happens, you can get a backup from the previous day. However, if say on the other scenario, you make some changes, things mess up, and you created a lot of content, changed around your website. The difference here is that your backup could be from a week previously and you could lose out on a lot of, say, content created or whatever it is that you did to your website. So this is something you might wanna consider like if you wanted to use the business plan. Another good reason why you might want to, even if you're a beginner. So beginners are definitely here, but still, if you want a little bit more power and you just want more websites, more visits, and that daily backup, business just might be for you. Cloud Startup is going to be pretty straightforward if you just want a ton of websites, a ton of visits monthly, a lot of gigs, and so on and so forth. That would definitely be for you if you just want a lot of power and performance and just features overall. So pick the one that's going to be best for you. I hope that quickly helps you when it comes to deciding. In this example, I'm just going to be going with business, so you can click on the plan that's best for you. But here I'm going to click on choose plan in the middle. All right, so we made it to the cart section where we can choose our pay period. But before we do, let's get to the fun part. As you can see on the right, there's going to be a 71% discount and even better, you want to make sure you click on the have a coupon code section. So what I did for you specifically, if you look in the description or the pinned comment underneath my link, there's going to be a coupon code. Simply type that in or copy and paste it and click on apply and you're going to get an extra discount. My way of saying thank you so much for watching. Now, I don't want to say what it is specifically because similar to my link, I am always updating it to make sure that you're getting a great discount and of course that the coupon code didn't expire. So that's my way of saying thank you for watching this video and following along. You can save a little bit more. Now let's talk about the pay periods. So the best possible value in deal here is going to be paying with 48 months. It's going to renew at $14 a month after it is done. But something to also keep in mind, you get your free domain. And with this one specifically, you get three months free. So this comes out to around $4 a month. Okay, so let's go over here. When we go to 24 months, it comes out to $4.49 a month. It's going to renew at $14 a year. With this one, you get your free domain as always, but you don't get those free three months. And then we move to 12. So it went from $4.49 to $4.99 a month. It renews at $14. And once again, you get your free domain. Then there's going to be this one. I never recommend that anyone uses it. Right off the bat, it's just simply going to be $14 a month. There's going to be a five setup fee. You're not getting your huge discount and is really not a good reason to use this specifically in my opinion. I would never do this and I wouldn't recommend it to anyone else. Plus, when you're using a website, ideally you want to have it around for at least a year. So it makes the most sense to pay whether it be 12, 24 or 48. 
It's really up to you which one is going to be best. You can make that decision yourself. But of course, this one would be the best value overall. It's going to renew at $14. You're saving the most money here. And of course, you do get that free domain and three months are free included in this order. So pick whichever one works best for you. Also, I want to say make sure you do enter in that coupon code down below. Click on apply. And after you've done that, click on the continue button right here. So there are two more steps when it comes to buying hosting from Hostinger. What you want to do is register for your account. I've already done this specifically. I already have an account, so I don't want to go through the process, but I will just let you know what happens. Make sure you enter in a primary or a main email address here. You can do it by email address and password, or maybe just register with Google. Regardless of what you do it, they're going to be sending you the important details for your account and the information. That's why you want to actually make sure it is a legit email that you have. After you've done that, click on register. And the last section is just going to be the payment where you can go in and pay, whether it be, you know, card, PayPal, whatever it is. And it's going to just give you a list of the things that you get on the top right. And keep in mind, notice how I did talk about how it comes with a free domain. That is going to be something that you get once you actually pay. So it will be on the inside of your hosting or account. In case you were curious about that, because I did mention it a few times, and a lot of times, you know, they'll have you type it in. They just have you do it after you make the purchase. So yes, you do get a free domain as long as you don't do the monthly versions. Nevertheless, that is going to conclude this tutorial about how you can buy hosting from Hostinger. I really hope that it helped you out. And if you were just watching the video to see how it works, you can also follow along once again by clicking the link in the description or the pinned comment and make sure that you use that coupon code when you get to that specific section to help you save even more money. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and I hope that you enjoy Hostinger as much as I do.